Hello, this is Mr. Collier, and today we're looking at equivalence and logic. Okay, equivalence, uh, you can also call it if and only if, and sometimes abbreviate IFF for if and only if. Um, and we denote it with this symbol right here. So basically, it's like a, it's a double conditional. If uh, P then Q is true, then the, and it's converse Q then P is true, then P if and only if Q is true. So it's only true when we have P implies Q is true and Q implies P is true. Um, okay, so first example here we have for P and Q below, describe P uh, if and only if Q. First one's done for you. Okay, so we will play tennis, it is fine. We will play tennis if and only if it is fine. Okay, so the second example would be uh, Mary will pass Mary will pass math if and only if the exam is easy. It's kind of like an if statement, but uh, it's a bit more powerful than that if and only if means that Mary will pass the test uh, if the exam is easy, but only if the exam is easy. Okay, if it's hard, she will fail for sure. Uh, so next, let's look at the truth table for this. So we already know P implies Q is only false if P is true and Q is false. So this is the false one right here, and the rest of them are true. Q implies P is only false when Q is true and P is false. So that would be this one right here, third one. Okay, so the statement, uh, statement if and only if is uh, only true when both of these uh, statements are true, the conditional statements are true. So that's true here and true here, and then the rest are false.